as many Arduinos as I have, I decided to buy yet another one from Adafruit LLC because this is the very first batch of Arduinos that is actually made in the US by Adafruit. So let's see what they look like. Very much like the old ones in the box. A little bit more colorful box than before. Assembled in the USA. I wonder if I have the 66th Arduino, that'd be cool. Um, let's see what it looks like. Yeah, I, I think that they've done so much for the community, uh, we need to support them. So even though I buy a whole bunch of stuff from China, I always try to buy a few things from Adafruit. Wow, so that's what it looked like compared to the old one. It's a different color, I think. Yeah, that's a different color. I'm sure everything else is the same. Well, let's plug it and see what happened. So I plug it in and there's a blink sketch already running in there. I didn't upload this. Apparently after they assemble the Arduino, they upload a blink sketch to make sure it works. Cool. That's quite in contrast to my Nano clones that I got from China that sometimes it doesn't even have a bootloader. So I brainstormed a little bit as to what I want to do with my first USA Arduino here. I'm going to have a distance sensor here, ultrasonic distance sensor. And so I, as you move back and forth, this display will reflect the distance. And I thought I could put it in the garage and have a little sensor for my car so I won't run into the garage wall. Let's keep going. Well, thanks to the awesome Arduino libraries, I got this done pretty quick. Let me show you. So as I get closer to the wall, the LED moves that way. So I move away from the wall, move this way. And of course, in the garage, instead of the device and the LED itself moving, it'll be the car that's moving closer and further. So, pretty happy. <laughs> it uh, didn't take that much at all. Uh, I'll share the code in the description. I'll talk to you guys later in the next video. Bye-bye.